Hello Marvel Heroes fans, my name is Wilfred Wong and welcome to this channel where you see videos and guides on this free to play game called Marvel Heroes. If you like this all guys, there's a link at the description of the video back to my website, a whole list of video and guides for you to watch. Today let's talk about the uh, Deadpool, the rounding off the part 3 of, uh, of this entire series. I've talked about the uh, range build which is possibly the highest potential, talk about the uh, melee build as well which is very fun, effective as well. And now let's talk about Pineapple Surprise, the area build, the last build that he has. And in this specialization, um, you know, we are converting a lot of power into area power. So in a patrol environment, in a danger room environment, it could be quite useful as well. So what kind of power I'm talking about, like for example, the little Deadpool now uh, does a lot more damage and has a cooldown. And also the Hulk Hand Arrow as well being buffed. Uh, bang Boom Pow has, uh, you know, always creak. And uh, instead of Foot Gauger, it is going to be a Kaboom. Uh, that is the only thing I don't like about this power is that it does uh, damage to Deadpool himself and also it's a smaller range but I mean it is one of the power layer that you could use uh, as for the main spender there are a couple of choices I'll talk about it in the in the build kind of like a portion of the video but I'm going to go with the Canadian devil now it may not be the most obvious choice but I don't want him to play like a range or melee I want to play him claim something different and this is hilarious so I'm heading into the cosmic danger room right now and uh, you can see him in action all right all right, Cosmic Danger Room with the rather, you know, high challenge rating, 51. Uh, quite a few modifier that could be quite challenging as well. And the uh, duplicator balls, random balls and so on. So let's go. So this is the uh, Canadian Devil. And the, uh, okay, let, what do I need to do? Probably just head to this part here. I probably need to save someone here. Silver lag and uh, save. Uh, so I mean this sort of thing is quite nice, uh, look at all these things here. Yeah. I don't know why the, the whole... Uh, it, it's kind of a bit lag, a bit laggy kind of thing because I, I thought I did this ever lag but it just doesn't register. Hmm. It's always one of these things that uh, make it more challenging. Alright. So just need to sort of like this Canadian Devil, very nice. Uh, it does both melee and range. Probably first of its kind. Wow, okay so I have to be careful. Alright, so that is one defeat. Um, ah. Yeah, alright, so that is uh, one on me. A little bit reckless, so now I need to be a bit more careful. The whole car of like a. Uh, alright, so that guy is saved. Okay, let's head to the next few of them. Right? I thought there's a... Oh, there's a shield age. I was wondering what is that icon? Is the icon over there? Yeah, he's still doing his... his uh, it's one thing great about the uh, thing is that although... Although you do the... Um, teleport, he's still doing Canadian Devil. Right? So this thing this thing here, even after teleport, is still doing the, the thing. Okay, so this is the boss. Uh, have to be a little bit careful. Right. Right, one, two, three... Okay. Right, this throws out this uh, barrel there. It's kind of useful. Okay, uh, let's not be too reckless. <laughs> Alright, let's have a lag. And you want to. Right, so that's it. And the uh, another unique. Nice. Save this agent here. One more here. Right, another one. Last one here. So okay, let's not be too reckless. This now was a little bit um, testing a limit. Well, I think I do have cutting room floor though. By the way, yeah, I, I should have died, you know use it. When the thing get a little bit dicey. Okay, done. Uh, so what do I need to do? Wow, well, I need to eliminate the rest of it. Oh, okay, next level. Fine, next next simulation. Okay, uh, step one, search the uh, pile. Okay, let's go. That is the um, the beauty of Deadpool. Just no spirit cause. Wow. 
Let's throw some barrel, man. This yeah, it's just... Uh, I, I'm a bit impatient when it comes to barrel throwing. Okay, so this is the pile that I need to what, search, is it? Stop me if you heard search. This well, I can't because there are all these things here. Alright. This pile is empty. Okay, how about this pile over here? This pile is empty. Alright, fine. How about this? Wow, this has a whole bunch of stuff here. Alright, let's just uh, do my uh, do the thing I do best. Deadpool. There's a lot of like, uh, things here I could. Uh, if only I could throw some of these things. Um, hmm. Wow, pretty intense, yo. I mean, uh, Deadpool also quite somehow, you know. What's his damage reduction here? Hang on a sec. It's uh, 53%, should be quite decent, no? Hmm. Okay, where's the pile? Maybe I need to sort of like focus on mission here. A little bit distracted um, onto this thing. This pile is empty. So I guess there's, uh, there's only like... Um, yeah, I have to be a little bit careful with the kaboom though. Uh, like I always get a little bit nervous. Uh, so you have to how ready to heal yourself back up after you kaboom. That's it. This pile is empty. It sounds like the main ape thingy, huh? It's all scripted. You have to do five, I don't know how many times anyway. Alright, Canadian Devil. Alright. And uh, there you go. Come on, man. There's a lot of barrel here, though. I should uh, make use of some of this, like, um. Okay, I think I can search the barrel. I will search the pile. This one must be something in there. Whoa, so this is the virus carrier. Ebola. Alright, just a Canadian devil. See, it's quite cute. Huh? You just have to, uh, you know, it's quite relaxing though. Look at this guy, man. He's been like going round and round in a circle. Three, four. Heal. Alright. I mean, damage wise, I mean, it's hard to say whether he's doing a lot of damage or not. Uh, yeah. But uh, definitely, it's pretty fun to play. Of course, if you want the best results, use a slam. But it just play too much like the uh, melee. See? Cutting room floor as well. Look, I've got quite a lot of backs. But that requires a little bit of like, um, um, you know, uh, hop, hop out dancing to have that. Okay, uh, it does feel like a little bit long, definitely. Alright. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm not really expecting Canadian Devil to be any high DPS anyway, but now you guys can see whether it's still your cup of tea or not. Your choice. Okay, um... This one actually took the, took the while, huh? Hmm. Alright. Well, at least I think I'm getting there. I think after this guy is down, then I, I probably could, um... Could, uh, sort of like face the main boss already. Okay, man. Actually, actually, my finger is getting tired holding the hot key <laughs> because uh, for Can Canadian devil, you have to hold the key, uh, hold hold the button like just non-stop holding it. Unlike the uh, you know other kind of thing, so, even when you are not like you know using it, you still have to hold it. I have this strong feeling that I would get it sorted before before this guy is down because of the uh, see I told you completed. I don't even get to get it down. See, it disappear. I get robbed. That could have been my two unique inside. Anyway, uh, Medikev, man, this is hard. Uh, okay, anyhow, I've got something here as well. Oh, Taskmaster and um, Kingpin. Okay, chop chop, let it get done. <laughs> two of them. This is not going to be easy, man. Ah, I tell you what, let me just ultimate the guy up. Um, 
Alright, so this ultimate. I don't know how much you can wear it down though, uh, to be honest. Wow! Silver lag! Silver lag! I got a lag on the silver lag. Can you believe it? Seriously. Okay, I, I think I need a little bit of like a uh, kind of like a uh, focus here. You know what? I, I'm gonna cheat and throw all that I can onto. <laughs> Alright. Wow. How about this? Take it, Medicaid. This is. This is very fun. Super that. I think by the time I threw all the barrel to them, it's, it's done deal, huh? Probably. Wow. I don't know, man. I, I can't. I can't seem to hold the barrel. It's so hard to target. I'm, I'm having a, my finger cram right now already. All right, <laughs> that's it. In barrel, we trust. So I mean, even all these small guys here, like you know, really taking a lot of like you know nonsense here. So anyway, I mean, uh, one defeat on the uh, something that I couldn't kind of like uh, see coming a little bit too reckless in the beginning. But um, I mean, yeah, that's it. Splinter man, rare commodity. Next one. So I hope you get an idea of how the uh, area kind of built plays like a little bit more scarier than the uh, than melee build or even the range build. But uh, you know, by all means, I mean it, it's just another build to sort of like uh, spice up your life as um, as 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 a, as a Deadpool. I mean, I do have three. Um, I purchased another specialization tab just because of the pineapple surprise. So anyway, head back to the training room and talk a little bit about the build. All right, on to the build. Uh, like my previous videos on this kind of like a brand new review heroes. You just have to follow the specialization, uh, whatever it says it's been buffed, use it. So things like the uh, Leo Deadpool, Hulk Hand Arrow, Foot Gauger, and uh, uh, Bang Boom Pow is something that you should just max it the four powers. So the only thing you can think of is, uh, is whether or not uh, you should take the Bang Bang or Canadian Devil or the Slam Jam. Now the choice is yours. I would say that um, you know Canadian Devil, as you see, is a little bit different in both Deal, uh, melee and uh, range. The damage though it doesn't seem to be a lot because you know it does seem to take a while to get things sorted. But I thought I'd put it on video to sort of like, be open with you. Um, if you take the Canadian Devil, it may not be like the best kind of like power for, for you to move forward, but it is one option. Another one, of course, is to use the, uh, the slam, slam gem because um, um, I would expect this one to be probably the highest potential. If you are doing the melee kind of thing because anyway kaboom is something that uh, you need to do it at the melee range you can't really do it too far away and also mind you this power is it's not really helpful in some of the danger room scenario whereby um, uh, you know if your hero can't be healed then you know you don't really want to use kaboom so you lose one of the uh, layer if you use this specialization but having said that i mean you know the uh, slam jam i tried before is pretty decent it's just that if i play slam jam i may as, may as well play the melee build because it's more effective if i use bang bang then i may use the uh, you know I, I may i may use the range build because it's more effective However, if you want to stick by the area build and say, that, okay, I really like the area build, so I would say the choice between Bang Bang and the Slam, uh, slam Jam is that if you, if you go for the um, awesome uh, build, because some of you may be geared for awesome, uh, so you know, Bang Bang will probably give you a higher potential, otherwise it's a Slam Jam. And the, uh, so either one is fine really, but this one is something special, may not be the best out there, but it is kind of fun to have as well. And the, uh, what else we'll talk about, the uh, Deadpool point of view, uh, nothing much really, healing factor, max it, uh, it's nice to heal, uh, it's nice to all these uh, regen as well, uh, work with the mouth as well, because it's all crit damage and brutal, as well as silver lag, uh, just max those. Uh, in terms of which of the silver lag you want to do, um, you know, I use power up because uh, as a Canadian devil, you got to, you know, move around anyway so you got to pick up all these uh, teddy bears so that's kind of worked uh, quite nicely and the, uh, so yeah there's pineapple surprises and I'm not going to talk about the gear as well because gear do check out my melee video uh, it's exactly the same gear that I use um, and yeah I mean I hope this sort of video is useful to you not 
don't want to overstretch the entire pineapple surprise because in a way it is also a deviation from the uh, from the melee build or range build in a sense so um, if you like this sort of guys and video check out my other videos as well and uh, do feel free to engage me in game or in youtube or in steam and i'm more than happy to help you guys uh, on whatever you guys are facing all right see you next time goodbye